Hi all, I wanted to quickly show you how to log in to Google. I'm sure most of you know how to do that. And also find the Google Photos albums for turning in our assignments. So the first thing you want to do is be able to go into Google and then to go ahead and sign into this using your Amarillo College account would be the best way of probably doing that. So once you get logged in, up at the top right, you'll notice the little dots up here, little squares for the apps. If you'll scroll down, you'll see photos listed here. When you go into here, you should see probably something different than what I have, what you, what I have on my screen here. But you should also be able to go to under sharing on the left and see the folders that are shared with you. Now these are for two separate classes here. So there are different ones that are in here that you'll see that you may not see that are meant for other classes here. Uh, so when we're looking here, we can see our first assignment that we're coming back to, which is photographing people. And when you go into here, you'll see the folder. And this is an image that I had posted up there just so that you could be able to see something in the folder itself. To add your uh, photo for this, you can go up to the little Add to Album icon here and go in here. You can select from your computer or if you have it already in your photos in Google, you can just select a picture that will go in there. But I'm going to go to Select from Computer and I'm just going to go up here and just select something. I don't know what exactly I'm going to select, but we'll... We'll go through here and find a quick picture maybe that I can use for doing that. So I've got this one here that's a family portrait here and open that and it's going to upload that photo into the album itself and it should be where everybody will be able to see and be able to view those photos here in just a second. So there we go. We'll see them here. When you click on one of the photos here, it will come up and you can come over to the right to write your comments onto the photos as well. Okay. And you can go in and be able to say, you know, whatever it is that you like to say here, uh, in it to the individual and try to be as, as, you know, um, eloquent in your wording and be able to be very specific about your details more than just nice portrait or doing that. Uh, that way you'll have some better feedback coming across with those pictures as well. Okay. And so you can post that and it will show in that activity up there as well. All right. So any questions on this, just let me know, but this is kind of the basic way that we're going to go and use for posting this. Now, I'll also have a, a separate video, hopefully here soon, on being able to do this on iPhone or uh, one of the other Android phones as well. Uh, you can download the Google app and be able to use it for uploading pictures and viewing others' pictures as well. So if you're in a case where you don't have a, a great camera and you want to use your cell phone for taking the photos, you can be able to upload it that way. You can also use the uh, Google Photos as a way of transferring pictures from your computer uh, and getting them to your phone as well. So just different ways of being able to access. I think this will be a nice way because we'll be able to see everybody's work and be able to do comments and talk about them a little bit more. Talk to you later.